keeping it real. Keeping it real is completely unheard of when it comes to the mind. The mind's predicament is extremely fascinating when we can actually start to comprehend what the mind is doing. The mind is essentially comparing and consulting how to compare and how to consult. It is looking within the realm of possibility to create infinite possibility from being possible. The mind is coding a sense of limitation. And it's predicting that limitation. And unless we break away from the mind, we will only be predictable. The heart has the ability to break the chain of the mind's forecast. Unless we break that chain, we will always be predicting a certain outcome. Human nature, human nature is not predictable. Something has happened which has essentially changed the way humanity has has come into this present moment. Time is, it might be a little bit hard for a lot of people to hear, but Time is only a state of awareness. When we are perceiving time, we are only perceiving a certain point of attention within presence. So essentially, the human has been, you could say, evolution. It doesn't matter. But the truth is, within this present moment, the human mind has come to this point of time but the human heart has always existed. So the mind has slowly been conditioned or slowly has been um, carnated to this present point of existence, but the heart has always existed. How is this possible? Is because the code within the heart, the beat, the pulse, the vibration has never changed within the heart. Now, this is very, very important because the mind has slowly changed, but the heart hasn't. Why? It's because human beings are actually fields of energy which are being used to replicate a sense of imagination. Now, within this imagination, if you can control the vibration, you can ultimately allow that vibration to perceive life, which has happened, which is essentially us. Now, when you take that vibration and you create an imagination of failure, suffering, hurt, ultimately vibrations which aren't true to the heart's identity, but they're an image of Um, essentially the opposing force. The heart is love, it's truth, it's satisfaction, happiness, devotion, generosity, kindship. And when the mind can take that force and ultimately turn it upside down, it will create a... um, it will will create an imbalance within uh, society. As long as we're being predicted we will always follow this opposing imbalance and and comes hurt anxiety stress worry hatred anger jealousy but when we can actually start to link back to our heart we can truly start to beat within our own heart space and stop to be affected by the injustice of our own Um, being because it's not us which is doing this it's a force or a identity which is using our true self against ourself to create a cosmic charge